Niger's transitional authorities have suspended all cooperation with the International Organization of La Francophonie. This was announced in Niamey on Sunday, December 24, in a press release issued by the National Council for the Protection of the Homeland. This was in response to the decision taken on Tuesday, December 19, by the Permanent Council of La Francophonie, which met by video conference. It decided to suspend Niger's membership from La Francophonie, condemn the July 26 coup, and called for the release of the ousted President Mohamed Bazoum, who has now been under house arrest for five months. But for the new authorities in Niamey, the International Organization of La Francophonie has lost all credibility and is described as an empty shell. In the voice of Colonel Major Abdurrahman Amadou Djibou, the National Council for the Protection of the Homeland and the Government of Niger recalled that the International Organization of La Francophonie was preceded by Agence de Corporation Culture Technique whose birth certificate in 1970 was signed in Niamey. This intergovernmental cooperation, based on the sharing of a common language, was the idea of the founding fathers of the institutional francophonie, notably Hamani Diori of Niger, Habib Bougiba of Tunisia, and Prince Norodom Sihanouk of Cambodia. In their declaration, the National Council for the Protection of the Homeland and the Government of Niger declared that La Francophonie is no longer an instrument of reconciliation, but rather an instrument used by France to defend and promote its interests in Africa, and that the decision to suspend Niger from multilateral cooperation is a response to the dictates and interests of France. In their press release, Niger's transitional authorities call for the decolonization of minds and the promotion of national languages in accordance with the ideals of the founding fathers of Pan-Africanism.